Historical snowfall this year has some worried about what will happen when all the snow melts this spring. But as Universe Live reporter Robin Christensen found out, Provo City has plans for how to manage the snowfall and flooding. Meteorologists say the record snowfall this year may impact spring runoff and flooding. City engineers watch the snow conditions closely year round. Provo City has a team that gives input on the water systems. So we always have a hand in, in designing the system and, and, so, and saying what gets put in. Preparing for the snowpack starts with city officials' input on the plans and designs for the water system's developments and infrastructure. Most of the water comes from the high Uintas. Right now, those mountains are around 120% of the annual snowpack. Runoff will flow into the Jordanelle and Deer Creek Reservoirs and then the Provo River. All of those water flow sites are only at 50% capacity because of the recent drought. Those reservoirs will fill, but not necessarily have a lot of extra water. Additionally, Provo City works to construct and maintain drains, gutters, and sewers throughout the city. Even with the extensive preparation, the biggest threat to spring flooding is the temperature. If it stays really cold and then turns hot, and that's when we have issues. This year we have even more snow and the big concern is that it's going to melt all at once. The Provo City engineers say they don't foresee a huge spring flooding but are prepared if anything would happen. We are prepared to divert it a different way so it doesn't harm anyone's property or homes. Or the team is also equipped with around 160,000 sandbags and a BYU volunteer team is on standby to help fill and place those sandbags. We have a sandbag filling machine that can fill sandbags in 10 seconds per bag. There's also a team of maintenance workers that are available to help residents with flooding and can be contacted through a hotline at 311. Reporting for Universe Live in Provo, I'm Robin Morris Christensen.